you, darling. And I hope you love that message. Please remember, we're not just telling stories, we're changing Welcome back, guys. Sorry. <laughs> that was definitely not Darman having a bad day because, <laughs> yeah, he seems to be going in the bass boost at speed. So, you obviously read the title of this video. That's right. We're going ahead and taking a tour on Eurape. Sorry to read the name, but it's basically the planet that you saw General Grievous and Obi-Wan fight at. So, yeah. As you can see, I'm Mr. Bones right now. And this is my trustworthy companion. He doesn't have a name. Oh, two. 2-1-B. Lame. Let's go. Oh, and by the way, let's, re let's go and talk to our old captain. He's a separatist like everyone else, so it's weird. Probably has more information. I don't know, let's just ask. Please, this is already embarrassing enough for me. Can we just get out of here? <laughs> well, uh, I'm sorry to say, my little friend. But no. Guard, dispose of this guy. But fight back, you piece of crap, come on. Yes, keep fighting. <laughs> I love to see this. Yeah, you better listen next time. Come on, my new companion. Let's go. So over here, we are going to be showing you the planet. You'll, you'll see it later of what we mean by where General Grievous and Obi-Wan Kenobi fight, even though unless you watch all the films, or... Uh, you know, one of my previous videos. You should watch it now. So let's head to the ship and go to the planet. Oh, you top bow. Wah. Your name. Let's go. So here we are, guys. This is the planet. So, you can only go to the kingdom. So look on top. This is basically where Obi-Wan was during Order 66. So this is the landing area. You can find these people here. They're actually good. Even I first thought that they were evil. I'm not even joking, I literally fought. No, they're actually just civilians. So I thought they were like sifts or something. Oh no, they're, they're just nice people. So down here is a quest. And you can go ahead and uh... You can find a bunch of uh... Buildings just hanging around there. So yeah, down there is just an entire... Basically, it's basically like, kind of like Grand Canyon. You can just find a bunch of water and rocks. You cannot go down there. You'll die. That's all I gotta say. And then it, it's kind of a challenge just getting all the way back up. So you you want to make sure that nothing happens. Like, you know, these things don't fall like you saw right there. So yeah, it's a really beautiful planet. Uh, let's keep going. I'll show you more around. We'll even talk to people. That guy's wearing a beanie. Okay. Here, let's talk to this guy. The sinkhole is rather deep, yes? We used to be able to reach caves in the cliff walls down there. But the hyperwinds decimated most of the root down. I suppose whatever was in them is still trapped in there. I, for one, 
We'll certainly not be attempting to get down there to retrieve anything. Okay, so then over here we have, uh, let's talk to this guy who's sweeping the place. Utapau is riddled with caves and hidden alcoves. The alcoves are my favorite, but the caves are nothing to sniff at. Okay. Yeah, this is the kingdom, uh, technically. So, uh, yeah, let's talk to this thing. Okay. So over here is the, uh, over here is another entrance. You cannot land here apparently, but uh, you can get a better view. You can find some characters talking. Uh, you have to press these buttons all in time, I think. For uh, oh yeah, I guess I'll show you how to do it. It's super simple. Oh wait, no, sorry, no, not in time yet. You have to find a code. <laughs> yeah, it's gonna be difficult. I I'm not doing that. Sorry. You hear characters talking or? Yeah, that preacher. Let's talk to him. The hyper winds forced us underground. But let me tell you, there are hyper winds down there that force you back up for air. Okay, then. You got to, like, climb all the way through here just to get to this area. Or there's, there's a cave. But I don't know why, I just like going this way. Let's talk to him. An outrageous display. My stable boy has not shown up for work. I hope for his sake he has fallen into the sinkhole. Would you be a darling and feed my varactyls? They're simply ravenous. Just place the food on a plate in front of any of the varactyls, then step back. They can be rather snappy. Oh, and some are more greedy than others. Well, uh, sorry. I didn't know that you were a she. So I guess down there is a farm, technically. Of those creatures down there. Uh, this tunnel actually leads all the way over here. So let's talk to this guy. Much to my dismay, it seems the Varactyls haven't been fed yet. Would you check their food containers on the cliffside by their pens? I'm too posh to do such tasks. So that has to make this the farm. You can also find uh, a bunch of these guys here. They don't attack. Even if you're a Jedi. Actually, do they attack? I'm just gonna become a, a hero quick. Hold on. Nope, they don't attack if you're a Jedi. So they're technically harmless. Okay, and sorry, that's my sister in the background. So, uh. Next we. Over here, yeah, that, that over there was a farm. Over here you can find more explosives. This is actually the center of the entire kingdom. And then we have, uh... Up here, you, you can go up here. You can find these clones walking around. Or, sorry, they're not clones. They're, uh... Sorry, clone troopers. Sorry, I get, I get them confused. Let's talk to him. A city built within a sinkhole. It sounded incomprehensible at first. However, the alternative was being blown miles into the air by hyperwinds. Okay, so then over here. Oh uh, yeah, there's a lot of nice views. Over here, uh... 
Did you, you, actually, you actually climb up the entire city? Or, you know, kingdom, I guess, technically. There's the bridge that leads over here. And over here you can find the, uh, I guess a house? Or, I, I don't know, consider this like a storage room. Over here you can find, uh, I guess another room? Oh wait, no, sorry, this is the farm. I got them mixed up. We can also uh, redo the quest over here. And, uh, over here I already showed you. So let's go inside some places in the kingdom. Let's go inside. So in here we have. That's right. We have uh, an experiment room. Or I guess a museum. Yeah, it's a museum. So uh, you can find all a bunch of bottles. And uh, you can find some tools, crystals, mainly crystals and rocks. And yeah. You can find a bunch of people in here. None you could talk to, though. There's also a cube they have to break out of that chest. And then we have... And then over here is just more hallways. I'll climb us to the top later. Over here is another place. Let's see what's inside. We're not letting him break this. Hey, you. I'm Mr. Bones. Put the dumb gun down. I'm your general. Are these guys just possessed? Yeah, I wouldn't worry about your shop. I would worry more about the fact that you're gonna live. Come on. No one's robbing anything. Uh, I'm sorry your store was technically destroyed, because it kind of is. Uh, let's just see what he has to say. As a show of my eternal gratitude, you may help yourself to the contents of my safe. Poverty frightens me no more. So yeah, I guess you have to help that guy out, so this is a technically never store. And then... So far that's it, um... Oh yeah, over here... Is more caves, let's see what this guy has to say. Or sorry, girl. You may be able to ride them, but you can never fully tame a Varactyl. So I just act like everything my Varactyl does was on purpose to convince others of my training abilities. Yes, that's right, my pretty. Devour my shoes. So over here you can find more crystals. Let's see what he has to say. There's a valuable stowed up there. Oh, what a cumbersome resting place. I shan't be doing anything about it. I wouldn't even muster the effort to watch you go get it. Oh, I'm terribly boring, aren't I? So 
So yeah, I guess this is technically a cave. It leads you all the way up here. And... Yeah, it leads you back up to the farm. So let's go ahead and uh, climb up this base and see what's on the top. Probably just more shops, but we're of course going to show you them all. So up here, you can find some stairs, ladders. And here's the center, actually, the real center. You can find a cube at the center, a bunch of jewels, uh, crystals, more clones. And then over here, are more characters to talk to. Let's go in this shop. Or place. So it looks like this is the clone trooper experiment room. So this is where they keep all their stuff. You can find a bunch of bottles, them uh, getting notepads out, stuff like that. These don't explode, by the way. It's a tip, because everyone assumes that these explode. So then let's go out, since that's all there really is in there. And then we're going to, uh, let's go in here, actually. So over here, leads you back up again. And you can find a bunch of caves, which are very small characters. This guy only wants a bounty hunter. Let's just see what he has to say. I think this is the leader. Yeah, this is the leader. I am sorry, but I have a task for a bounty hunter, which it seems you are not. Good day to you. Okay, so then... Oh, oh. Um... Okay, I see how to get out from... Uh, oh, whoa. <laughs> whoa. Well, you saw it was over there. <laughs> sorry about that. So over here you can find uh, how people get their food around here. And then, uh... Yeah, you can break these crystals around here, which will get you, uh, I'm pretty sure, a crystal. Another, uh, cube. And then... I guess it's fair that I, I do the mission. Only to show you around, I'm not gonna defeat creeps. And then we're gonna go all the way back. Greetings, young Jedi. I should like to use your city as a base, as I search nearby systems for General Grievous. He is here. Tenth level. Thousands of battle droids. Call for backup. <laughs> it won't be long before the armies of the Republic track us here. I am sending you to the Mustafar system in the Outer Rim. You will be safe there. <laughs> Hello there. General Kenobi. Yeah. Your move. You fool. I have been trained in your Jedi arts. I count to I will deal with this Jedi slime myself. I think he's talking to you, sir. Yes, I believe so. So yeah, here we are, guys. We're not gonna fight him, except he's gonna be chasing us. So this is the room that you battle him in. You'll find a bunch of guards around here, separatist guards. And then you would normally play as R2. Uh, there's a ton of 
um, cubes you could get in here during the battle. There's a bunch of bridges, and then it just leads all the way down there. There's ladders that lead all the way back up. This is literally like the main reason why this is hard. So, uh, on this side, let's come on, uh, come on, Obi Wan. Oh, and there we go. Okay, let's break this apart. And just an extra stud. That's that's cool. And you die if you go down there. So you cannot go all the way down. <laughs> that looks safe, sort of. She's like waiting right there. Um, Grievous. Ah, God. Okay. A nice way to welcome someone. I, I shouldn't have said hello there. Oh, I'm at the place as Commander Cody for now because General Grievous absolutely hates me. Okay. So, over here, ignore him. He's not going to be killing us. You could be seeing him for Separatist, and then you could actually go up here. We'll show you because we might actually have to fight him a little. And then here, over you could actually see the battle going on. I don't think you could get hit. Yeah, see, he goes past you. Oh my! I'm about to actually end this guy. So then you could, uh, you could actually kill these Separatists with one hit, they don't even attack. And you could even kill your own troops. Really easy, really fun. I kind of feel bad. And the weirdest thing about these guys is, you kill one, a new one comes out of nowhere. Just, they come out of the dark and kill the next Separatist, yeah, weird. So there's infinite. If you ever feel you need to get okay, all your stress out, just do this. Weird, I know. Let's use this machine. Okay, Obi-Wan. Can this guy give us like two seconds? I, okay, I know how to do this. Hold on. So, yeah, you could... Let's just finish this guy real quick before he does anything stupid. I guess we might have to end up killing him at the end. It depends. I'll even show you the cutscene where he dies. I don't think so. Bye, General Grievous. So far, that's one. Looks like he has backup. Copy that. Let's keep fighting these guys. And then we should be able to get up there. We mustn't lose sight of General Here, Let's do this. You have to keep shooting that and then use a grappler. And here we go. Oh, my God. 
Okay, so yeah, let's finally go up here. So we're at the final part of the one, in case you're wondering. So up here, you can see a nice glass look, and then there's you might have to you might want to press this so that way Commander Cody comes up to help you. And then yeah, over here you're chasing General Grievous. As you're seeing now, you find a bunch of robots you have to fight. Let's do this. Okay, Obi Wan, it's all up to you. So now we're at the very top right here. And yeah. We're here. Ends with ends like this so far. Uh, yeah, there, there's a bridge up here that General Grievous breaks. You have to find a way through, which is super uh, simple. And then, yeah. Let's get back to fighting. Come on, General. Is that all you got? Now I guess you're not even ranked enough to be a separatist at all. Let's get it. Okay. So yeah, you could go many. You have to fight these guys just to get through more. Also, so uh, they won't attack you really. And you have to fight these to get through here. I'll show you what's up on that side. Uh, once we, I'm done showing you probably another thing after fighting these guys. Don't worry, Commander. I got you. Is everyone okay? Let's uh, let's go back over here real quick. And you can, yeah, here's what you can do as Obi Wan. So you have to use your lightsaber, climb up here, and I think it leads you to a stud or a comp, you know, a thing. Try not to get crushed or anything. Oh crap. Oh. Oh. Uh, that did not go good. 
And then yeah. You just leads you back. What was the whole point of that? Oh, I see, yeah. No. Get you a mini kit. So then up here you can find just a bunch of more tools. You can even take these things off as Obi One, and then yeah, you can also come up here as Commander Cody if you saw right next to me. Yeah. Hey, look, it made a heart. Okay. I think it's also another way to get. Up to blazes that having to go for those guys if you're having trouble. So let's go on to the final part of this tour and defeat General G Grievous, and we'll end the video back on the ship. I would just jump up, like there's no point of using the thing if you know. Uh, hold on. There we go. So up here you can find more robots to fight, and you'll find General Grievous, you'll have to bring him back down. You need to draw Grievous out with some supporting fire. Cody, can you call for reinforcements? Should be able to get a signal out from that communication tower. Once I get to that communications tower, reinforcements will be on the way. Okay, so yeah, up here you can find uh, more droids, uh, you even get nice views, hold on. So yeah, up here you can find, uh, you can find this, I forgot to be a bounty hunter for that. And yeah, look at this, like a nice view, <laughs> for all those seats except you're the one who's fighting General G Grievous. Oh boy, I'm dead. And then, uh, yeah, you have to use this to uh, get the communications up and running. So let's try it. Sorry about that. Okay, let's go ahead and start. You ready, General? Come on. Let's do this. Uh -oh. Um. You know what? Let's just let's just act get to the fight. Come on. Civilized. Commander, contact your troops. Tell them to move to the higher levels. Very good, sir. The time has come. Oh. 
Well, guys, that is it for the tour. Let's head back. And, uh, yeah. We'll end the video once we get back to the ship. Let's do that. Welcome to my, uh, I, I mean, your ship, Captain. Please, this is already embarrassing enough for me. Can we just get out of here? I'm sorry. You're the only, you're literally one out of millions of separatists. There's only like one difference with you compared to all of them, and that's literally just the extra orange spot. Right there on your chest. No difference. Well, it's because you're smart. Dude, they can all talk too. So... That's right. Look okay, at me. I defeated way more than enough Sifts. You haven't even defeated a single clone troop. So why don't you go ahead and sit there like a good kid? Maybe then I won't even make you go to work. After all, it looks like you need a job because you're on deploy, dude. Oh. <laughs> okay. Okay, that was fun. So, yeah, guys, that is the video. And uh, in case you want to know more about, like, uh, the next Star Wars movie tw that's coming out in 2025, uh, please make sure to watch it. And, uh, yeah. Let's just go ahead and finish this guy. Yo, crew. Do your job and kill him. Kill him. Come on, shoot him. Oh wait, I have a knife? <laughs> shoot him. He's right there. It sounds like the critical hit sound effect. I might actually do a video of that later. Right there, dude. Come on, do your job. Then, otherwise, then you're going to the scrap pile. Come on. Thank you. Shoot him. Kill him. Come on, end him. Oh, thank God, dude. That guy was annoying. Also, no, nah, I'm, I'm not like ever Palpatine. Nah, I'm gonna betray you all. Well, uh, yeah, guys. I guess that's already the end of the video. Please make sure to like and subscribe, and we'll see you guys next time. Ryan, out.